Who's well, better looking, me or dumbfounded? Oh, I don't know. Probably him, I think. That hurts. Does it really? A little bit. But you know what? In a different way. You're better looking more in like a historical way. Old? <laughs> no, no, no. What is that? <laughs> yeah. You're right. We Damn. put Liam Neeson in it. So close, He's your dad. Dude. Yeah, we're so close with a fucking great movie. Oh. Yeah, we just need a little, you know. Yeah, dude. Fuck. That's all right. We got time to think about how do, it. How do you think this movie is doing that you and I are doing? I think it's interesting, man. I mean, first of all, it's been interesting to do a movie for me, and I wasn't going to do it unless you did it, which is kind of crazy. came down to the wire, huh? I know. We were calling each other like every five minutes going, are you going to do it? Are you going to do it? Are you going to do it? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I know. And we're doing it. I just feel like it's, I feel like it's right. The cast is right. And I just feel, you know what? I, I'm proud of you because you're killing it. Oh, thanks, You man. really are. Thanks. And I, um... Obviously, because you haven't done a lot of movies, right? Yeah. So there was a kind of like, oh, what is he going to do? But you're like being real, being very funny. And um, I think this will be good, man. You do? Oh, yeah. If it sucks. It's Dude, gonna... I saw that fucking last take, what Johnny did, and I watched the camera. It looks so cinematic. Really? Oh, my God. It looks so good. Dude, your character is so crazy. Yours is too. Why is mine character crazy? I, I mean, he just like... He's just he's been, a weirdo. yeah, yeah. He's been through so much, though. I know, but yeah, dude. I think um, that scene with the chicken wings is hilarious. It's so ridiculous. I watched from that uh, editor thing or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Where like you're chasing the guy and yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right, we'll see what happens, man. But yeah, man. I think. Yeah, it was so funny because on Friday we'd be like, "All right, let's talk on Monday and see if we want to do it." And then on Monday, one Monday we're like, "Oh, we're not doing it, dude." And then the yeah, yeah, next yeah. Monday it's next like, Monday, "All right, we're, we're in." Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's weird. I just feel like uh, it was like kind of meant to be. I don't know. I like the guy, like. Yep, and it's about a sober living. Lodge is the director, and he wrote it. It's fun, man. Look, it's fun, and I'm glad I get to try and just learn it around you because it's like, you know, you wouldn't let me mess up if I was really doing bad. No. And Johnny Knoxville's in it, Mo Amer. <laughs> it's interesting. Yeah. Mo um, Amer, who else? Um. Oh, Gata. Gata. Gata's cool. Yeah. Dumbfounded. Gata's crazy, isn't he? Like he? dumbfounded? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Who's well, better looking, me or dumbfounded? Oh, I don't know. Probably him, I think. That hurts. Does it really? A little bit. But you know what? In a different way. You're better looking more in like a historical way. Old? I wouldn't say old. I would say you're very like, I feel like you have that look that has been through time. Yeah, that just, that, because I'll tell you why. We went to a club last night after the store. Did y'all? He goes, let's go to this Korean club. You guys went? Yeah, I went. And do y'all always do that? What is it like? What's it like when you see another Korean? Dude, do you, you should have gone. They would have loved you there. But if you see another Korean, do you know immediately that they're Korean? <laughs> what do you mean? Like, do you know? Well, he has a friend that looks Filipino, so sometimes you don't know. You know what I mean? His, he had like, you know what I mean? Monkey eyes. Oh, he had all of it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He had, you know, he had the Filipino round eyes. Oh, you know yeah. What I mean? and they were bulging out. You got the, it, you guys got those crescents, baby. Yeah, we know? have crescents, right? So him, I was like, "You're Korean." He's like, "I am," and I go, "Wow, that was shocking." But he looked good. I'm not saying I'm not making fun of him. I look handsome, you know what I mean? Yeah. But I went to the club, and there was this um, guy who that day had performed in front of sixty thousand people, and his name is Jay Park. He's like this huge Korean rapper singer. Wow. Right. So I was there at his table. Right. He's a huge fan. I don't know why. He's back in the, when he was. Everybody kid, loves you. When he was a kid, he watched Mad TV or whatever it might be. But so I hung out with the table. But I realized that night yeah. that I'm never gonna get laid again. Really? Yeah, because the women they don't look at me. They think that I'm like their accountant. Really? Dude, I'm being real, dude. An accountant where, dude? On like a shipping dock or something? <laughs> like a wooden, what do you mean? What do like you mean? a wooden shipping dock? No, like a. a I'm an accountant for like you know um, Bungie, the the you know gaming company. For what like a kind of I feel like it would be like hey kind of like a <laughs> what do you mean? You would be accountant for like sex trafficking or something. <laughs> yeah, but still an accountant nonetheless. That's you know true. What I mean? That's true. But they look at me like like not in in a viable way. Oh yeah. And they look like you know oh no not you you know what I mean? It, right. it, I just kind of feel it. So it's like I might be alone for a while, bro. 
I, I'm happy about it. I don't. I don't give a shit. But did you, you show up? Because here's sometimes this can happen to you. Show up to a thing. It's like a night. It's like a, fe a festival, not festive night. People are excited, and you show up with kind of like this. I get scared in those type of environments, kind of, and I show up with a lower energy, and so then I f I seem like the weird guy, you know. I think yeah, I do have a weird because I can't do my Bobby Lee my Bobby Lee isms in a club environment. You know what I mean? Because it's loud. People are walking around, so I'm just kind of like. You know, like biting my nails, and I'm in the corner. I'm in the table. I'm like, where? I'm at the table where everyone wants to be. Right. Finally, I get to the table, but now I'm like the dad. Yeah. You know what I mean? So I'm just sitting there, and you know, all these girls wanted to take photos with Jay Park, right? And dumbfounded, right? Oh. And every once in a dude, it's always a dude, some older Korean dude. Mm -hmm. I'm a big fan. Oh. Right? To me. And I'm like, oh, God, you have a dick, dude. Oh, my God, this is so sad. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. But it's like, uh, and they're older, and what are they wearing usually? Khakis. Oh. Golf shirt. Khakis, golf shirt, right? Oh, God. They have a dude. perm. <laughs> what? You, they, you know, Koreans perm their hair. Uh -uh. Yeah, Korean dudes perm their hair. Pull it up, Rodney. Yeah, Korean, Korean perm. perm. Yeah, Korean guys perm their hair. Oh, man. All my uncles did it. They all got their perms. <laughs> really? Yeah, because they didn't want to, they didn't like the straight A's. <laughs> Korean guys. Korean male perm. Do male. Wow. Like that dude down there. In Korean, a lot of Korean women look deceased, don't they, in the skin tone? <laughs> what do you mean? They have a very deceased looking tone on them. Like that guy right down there in the third row. Who is he? Yeah, the redheaded kid, like right there. Six oh, to the left, one more. Yeah, anyway, that, that right guy right there. there. Yeah, that. Wow. Like old Korean dudes do that too. Like Jack Harrow. Yeah, they want to, like, you know what I mean? Yeah. They want to look different. You know what I mean? Oh, they do, huh? Yeah. When it's like, you know, if you ever go to a Korean spa, we have straight pubes. Really? Yeah. It's like your dick is in shock. Oh, my God. And so it's like, ah, you know what I mean? And the hairs come out. You oh. know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. They like don't really, like if I plucked one out right now, you wouldn't think that that was from my fucking genitalia area. Oh, my God. Yeah. I didn't well, yours know. curl? Yeah, mine curl. Mine kind of seem... I mean, they seem anxious, I feel like, but they're curled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Most of mine are curled probably from sheer anxiety, probably. But, um. <laughs> you don't shave yours? Huh? I trim mine down now. Like, I, can I just show you? Huh? Can I show yeah. You? Oh, wow. Yeah. Look at the bump right there, dude. It's acne. It, <laughs> <laughs> Damn, brother. That's pure acne, bro. Damn. Yeah. Oh, I thought that was the penis. <laughs> No, oh, dude. I rock harder than that, dude. Oh, thank God, dude. If the, I would kill myself, if that was my deal. Oh, would you kill yourself? I mean, it's a pretty big zit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude. If I had like that little red bump as my penis, oh, forget it. I'd be a monk. What's the smallest a penis can be? Can you bring that up for me, brother bear? What's a small? They can be pretty small, bro. Yeah, do adult male too. Adult male. Yeah, yeah. Go to images. Smallest penis in study is about 1.6. Wow. Go to images. Yeah, let's go to images. Let's see if they'll give us anything. Okay, nothing. Nothing. You know what's better? Put in micro penis. Really? Yeah, I've just Googled it before. Why? Oh my <laughs> God, look at that, dude. What? Look at that little one right there. Yeah, that, that. Wow. Bro. Bro Would you kill yourself? Zoom in on that, huh? Would you kill yourself? Okay. Wow. wow. Oh, my. oh, poor guy. Right? Can you zoom a little more? <laughs> wow, look at that. Wow. It looked like a just like a boiled Dude, It looks like it has a little two eyes and a little face on top. It looks like a boiled peanut. <laughs> <laughs> it does. Doesn't it? it looks like a boiled peanut, dude. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. You know Imagine what that. Would be nice though, is you could probably play with yourself and nobody would even know. Yeah. Well you would you would just rub it like a clip. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like you could that's how you jerk out. You just rub it like that. <laughs> yeah. Dude, oh. you have to have you know to get a woman with that penis, you'd have to be Jeff Bezos. Yeah. You know, that's what you would have to offer. Uh, I'll give you a mansion yeah. and a yacht. Because this is nothing. Mm -mm. You'd have to be Elon Bezos. <laughs> right. What do you think about that, Zach, that wiener? Uh, it's a tough life, for sure. It's a pretty tough life, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. I'm sorry for the other image. That was an accident. It's okay, man. It, it's dangerous. You gotta understand, it's dangerous ground, that Google search, so. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. 
You know what I would do? You know what I would do with that? I would, I would, I would transition. You would? Oh I, I, yeah. I would for, forget it. I would just turn that into a vag. Oh, that's a great idea. And then you'd have the nicest little vagina. Like, you, a, yeah, it would be nice. I would. All you would have to do is because usually what they do when they do the transition, right, is they take a penis, they cut it in half, and they tuck all the penis and everything inside the body, wow. right? But with that, I wouldn't do that. I would just keep it as is, yeah, and just build the vagina around it, and that would be my clit. Ooh, wow! <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I, I just imagining it almost sounds like a very, it sounds like a delicacy, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, new man vagina. So, how about this? You meet a great guy, right? He's a cool guy. Who? Huh? I'm not telling you who he is because okay. I don't know who he is because it's just a magic. It's a magic person or made up, fictional. So you meet a great guy. He's really, really cool. Um, you love him. You end up falling in love with him. Gay love. Yeah. And then he says, Delante. Delante. I want him to be Delante Jackson. Delante Jackson. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So you're going, yeah. So he's I a know, mulatto. I know what you're doing. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah he's yeah. a mixed boy. He's a mixed boy. Yeah. And he gets a sex change do you still continue to see him wait i don't get the fucking scenario so what you're saying is i'm dating delante jackson mm -hmm. i'm not gay though all right that was a test <laughs> that whole thing was a test I, I know what you're saying to me is this if i was dating a, a black girl by the name a mulatto girl name um delicia okay delicia jackson and she goes, I'm going to be Delante, and yeah. I'm going to get the operation. Do you stay? I would leave. You would? Which, first of all, making a penis out of vagina is probably so difficult. Really? Because how? Unless they have a, unless you have unlit like a, a lot of vagina. Yeah, I guess you. Because what do you do? You borrow what fat from your leg or something? Yeah. Or you have to get a lot of. You have to have a lot of vagina. Wow. You know what I mean, a lot of vagina meat. Because they got to really jangle that thing up. Yeah, they got to jangle it up. Damn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, I don't know what that's gonna look like. Also, she's probably gonna take hormones, and her deep voice is gonna get deeper. Yeah. Or testosterone is that testosterone? Testosterone. Yeah. And she's gonna grow facial hair. At that point, it's gonna be nah. You're, right, I it's just tough because I don't know what the future holds. He's gonna for like you. Chris Spencer. I don't know what the future holds for you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I know nothing. There is no future.